Hi guys and welcome to another tutorial video of Wooza. In this video I'm going to explain to you how Big Buy dropshipping works in combination with the WooCommerce store. Big Buy is a dropshipping supplier supported in over 24 European countries in the categories electronics and home appliances. It has over 100,000 products in its entire catalog. One of the key benefits of Big Buy is that they have fast shipment in all supported European countries. So that's beneficial. And another beneficial thing is that we have developed a very nice, awesome, fast and stable WooCommerce plugin in order for you to connect with Big Buy Dropshipping. Dropshipping is a business model for webshop owners where they can literally sell the entire catalog of a specific supplier without the need to purchase large quantities. Once you receive an order within your WooCommerce store, you can send it automatically to Big Buy. They will then ship the ordered product directly to your customer from your name. You can say dropshipping is an easy way to start your own webshop. Now let's jump into the possibilities to automate your entire WooCommerce store in combination with Big Buy dropshipping. Before we start, you should download the Big Buy WooCommerce plugin via our website, wusa.com. No worries, we offer you a seven day free trial period, so no strings attached. Once you have downloaded the Big Buy dropshipping plugin via our website, you will receive a zip file and a license key. You need both to install and activate the plugin in your WordPress backend. Not sure how to install a plugin? We have written an article about it and it's linked in the description below this video. Once installed and activated, we can start configuring the settings of Big Buy. First, go to WooCommerce, then Settings, and click the tab Big Buy. There you will see some general settings. The first one is payment method. Moneybox is a deposit method where you need to deposit an amount into your Big Buy dropshipping account. And the second one we also support within two weeks from now from posting this video is PayPal. And with PayPal, the entire process of order placement is automated. We also have a preserved stock offset, which means if the stock at Big Buy is two, you want to uh, put the product offline um, because Big Buy has a lot of suppliers and webshops who make use of their dropshipping possibility. It can go fast when a stock is below two, for example. So therefore, you can say when the stock is two at Big Buy, please put the product offline into my webshop. Of course, we also have the authorization, which is the API key you will need from Big Buy itself. We have the shipping settings, so we have a couple of options. You can use the cheapest option, which means we will check what the cheapest option is for you as a webshop owner to ship the product. This also means that it will probably be the slowest option, or you can make a predefined list and give priority to some of the preferred shipping carriers. So for example, if GLS is your first priority shipping carrier, and it is available for a particular order, we will choose GLS. If it's not available for a particular order, then we will go to the second priority shipping carrier, in this case, Chrono. So based on the priorities you set here, we will choose what's available for that particular order. And last but not least, you should activate your license once you have downloaded and activated your plugin on wusa.com. Have all settings configured, then you can finally start with the real work importing the products. Therefore, go back to your WordPress backend and click synchronization. And let me quit the synchronization for now, because basically when you first attend this page, you will see the button is blue and you can start the synchronization. Basically, the first thing you need to do is select the language you want to use for your products. Um, in this case, I will use English. And then you should click to retrieve the category list. Of course, we have already done that. Then you can select and unselect categories, basically. So if you want to sell fitness goods, for example, you can unselect everything else and only have fitness and exercise equipment selected. You can also configure some other settings related to the products. Do you want to send the orders automatically based on a WooCommerce order status? Or do you want to do it manually, for example? What will be the minimum price of the product and the maximum price of the product? And what do we need to do with out of stock products? Do you want to exclude them in the import or include them? Also, you can choose whether to use the advised price or uh, to add um, a margin yourself. It can be a fixed margin or it can be a percentage margin. 
And also, once you have imported the products in WooCommerce, you might want to adjust them. For example, adjust the title or the description. Basically, you can select here what not to update when the stock amount is updated. So the stock amount is mandatory, of course, but for price and title, you can choose to not update them so that you can man manually adjust them. Once you are done with that, you can click basically start synchronization and you will see that the machine is running. And in this case, we need to do two things. So once these things are done, we will get to another step in this case, at first, we are collecting some information and the new product categories, if they're not created yet, will be created. And then the next step is probably the import of the products itself. If you want to have the process more in detail, you can also scroll down and you can see actually which action is running at this moment. So, and which priority it has. So therefore you can see what the plugin is actually doing. When we go back to product stem, you can also see what's imported and what's very good to know in case of big buy is that we at first will add the products via big buy in progress and then later on we will add the image and we will add the stock amount so basically once a product is still in big buy in progress it's not available on your website yet but know that it will be soon once we have updated all mandatory product parameters for selling depending on the settings big buy orders created in your woocommerce store will be sent automatically to big buy so that they can ship them to your customer from your name let me explain to you how this actually works. So in this case, I will go to front end of the site and let's just purchase a random product. Let's see the Aldovo Dominguez at to cart. And of course this is a test environment. So a payment will be done cash on delivery. In your case, it will be your own payment provider, of course. Then let's say place order, order received. And then when we go back to the back end and check the orders, you will see that uh, seven seconds ago, a new order is created uh, with ID 64068. And the status at Big Buy is processing at this moment, which means it is sent to Big Buy and we need to wait for positive response. In the settings, we said that we wanted to send the Big Buy order automatically if the order status is processing. So. Um, if the setting is correct, status is processing, then it will be sent to Big Buy. Once we have received a response from Big Buy, you can see it will show the following information. It will show the status processed, it will show the order ID at Big Buy, and it will show the tracking code of the actual shipment uh, at the shipping carrier. For example, when you use GLS like we discussed uh, earlier, then this will be a GLS tracking code. And therefore you can also search the shipment and the status of it yourself on the GLS website. So that's awesome. One of the benefits of importing products from Big Buy to WooCommerce is that you can adjust it. Like I explained before, you can select which parameters to update or not automatically. Uh, so this also means you can change the content of the product. So when we click a Big Buy product, you can see we can change the title, for example, of the product. We can change the description. Uh, we can change literally everything, the price. We can add attributes if we'd like. Uh, we also see all the information we have from Big Buy, uh, for example, EAN code, if you would like to publish it to Amazon or Zalando or Kaufland, we can add a product short description and we can also add our own images if we would like and product tags. So basically you can adjust everything uh, of a Big Buy product as long as you of course keep the custom fields in place so that our system still recognizes the product as a Big Buy product and we can update at least the stock amount. Last but not least, you should know a couple of things about Big Buy dropshipping in combination with WooCommerce. Product images won't be downloaded to your server because an average product at Big Buy has 15 plus images. You can imagine what this does to your server. You are able to edit all product content in WooCommerce. Make sure your settings are configured correctly so that the changes won't be overridden. Well, Dropshipping is a very popular business model and Big Buy is one of the most beneficial dropshipping suppliers for Europe. 
It supports over 24 countries in Europe. And like I said earlier, they have a fast delivery, a fast shipment, and they support like tens of shipping carriers which are supported in all European countries. So basically, if you would like to have your own web shop and you want to start with drop shipping, then Big Buy is a very good choice. And I would suggest you should take it into consideration and even try it at least for seven days within our trial period. So thanks for now. My name is Jessica Riesch. I'm the founder and owner of Wusa and we develop and maintain premium WordPress WooCommerce plugins. For now, have a great day and hopefully I will see you in the next video.